All right. Welcome back for another episode of All Things Radio. We're going to build us an armor lock cage, or we're going to attempt to. Let's get into it. Give me a reference mark here. Five and nine sixteenths. Just about halfway mark, so we know exactly where half is going both directions. We can just transfer that. Okay. Now right, we've put that in half. I'm gonna want to offset it to the front just a little bit more, and get to my controls a little easier. We're gonna offset that. Talk about where that back hole is even with the center of this. Give my coax more room. But I gotta worry about my mic too. We're gonna offset that just a little bit. You have to wait a minute now, but hold on. Probably take more than one try. That's all right. All right, now we gotta get our bolt size here. Just a little oversized, not too much. So that's a 150. I have I have a sheet back here hanging on the wall that's cheap, but let's see, 150 is 532nd. We're gonna go with 316ths. Just a little bit bigger. I don't want it to rub and then thread, so. This three sixteenths. If I still have a three sixteenths, I do have a three sixteenths. Told him. Center it the best we can. Down, especially on the radio side. Don't need no on the radio side. And we'll make sure they're not down this side. Just to make sure. These bolts here look like they're going to be long enough. So let's we'll see what that looks like. Precise measurements here. Get center. Then we'll come down here and we'll get center here. Center of that hole to center of that hole. Put a dot.
Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these two, match them up, mark those holes, match the front, really don't care what the back is, we're gonna match the front up. Get my Sharpie in there, mark a hole, mark a hole. There's my two side pieces. Alright, we got two totally different looks now. I don't know if you can see that on camera or not. A lot more shinier and smooth on this one. And on this one, it's kind of rough and dull looking. <laughs> 